I'm gonna wake up in this place again. All right, welcome to the sixth episode in the developer commentary series where we're gonna be going over SCPRP stuff and it's gonna be awesome. Cool. All right, so let's start by looking at the upgrades menu. And the upgrades menu is something I had to cl clear out my class menu for so I can uh, actually buy some stuff and get myself some money and whatnot so we can show you guys this awesome stuff. So here's the upgrades menu. Now on the right hand side you notice a bunch of information about the class that you currently are. That includes your description, how you earn SD points, and your standard equipment. Also a bunch of stats and whatnot down below. And on the left hand side you're going to see a scroll bar. And this is going to be every single class. If you want to organize it by um, Foundation or Chaos Insurgency or SCP, whatnot, you can do that by clicking on these tabs above. Now, notice that each one has the amount of SC points that are required to purchase the class. The site director is 2,500, and there's prerequisites to actually buy this class, which is indicated because this bar is black. That means I don't own all the prerequisites. So. Dr. Menard, Dr. Harp, Dr. Gears, and Chief Franklin are required before I can purchase the site director. So as you see, I click on site director, there's no purchase button or anything. However, for a class that has data expunged and has a green bar, it means I have all the required classes. So now I can purchase for X Men SC points. So now if I go to my classes, it says researcher right here, which is the one I just purchased. I can go become him, have fun, place my key card and all that fun stuff, open the Q menu. I might actually keep this in, I don't know. It's pretty fun. But anyway, um, let's go into some more upgrades just to show you guys. So we can go buy maybe SCP, buy that, our favorite sculpture, our nice old man, you know, you can do that. And these, let's show you how the prerequisites work. So for these I need to buy MTF Guard, right? So we'll buy the MTF Security, right? And then we'll get the MTF and now let's go get some Chaos Insurgency. So now you see I can buy CI Delta, which before I couldn't. CI Delta is going to be the prerequisite for the CI Zeta, so watch when I purchase CI Delta. Now we got CI Data, Zeta, rather, and now we can purchase that one. Alright, so now there's a bunch of classes. As you can see, it's all filling out correctly, and everything works fine. Uh, if you guys have any comments, feel free to leave so in the comments section below. If, or especially any critiques, I'm definitely receiving any kind of criticism that you feel like can help this series uh, since it's still in development. Anyway, if you like the content, as always, feel free to like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you guys in the next video.